Okay, this is how quick and easy DNA is. So I'm gonna use single leg stance as a movement assessment because I know I'm having issues today on my right leg. So left leg, we have a slight bend in the knee, tripod foot, equal weight under the ball of the big toe, little toe and heel. So I'm just gonna hinge, come forward, no problem with that. Same thing on the right. And already I can tell I'm having a hard time stabilizing that tripod foot. And I'm super unstable at the bottom and I'm feeling it right in here, okay? So I need to know, is this a physiological problem? Nope. Is this a limbic problem? Nope. Is this a structural problem? Yes. Is this something in the muscle? No. Is this something in a joint capsule? No. Is this something in a ligament? Yes. Do I need to deal with sacrum? Yes. Do I need to deal with fibula? Yes. Do I need to stim the fibular ligament? Yes. Do I need to stim category number one in the right sacrum? No. Do I need to stim category number two in the right sacrum? No. Do I need to stimulate category number three in the right sacrum? Yes. So I'm gonna stim. Stim, right now I'm just making sure I have those two things paired. And I just wanna make sure this is the correct thing that we're supposed to be working on. And that's already way better. So it's a ligament. There's lots of different ways to work with ligaments. So do I need to tap the ligament? No. Do I need a pin prick to the ligament? No. Do I need a rub to the ligament? Yes. So I'm gonna rub down here at my fibular and then rub back here in category three, which is down near my tailbone. And then I'm gonna ask, is this safe to proceed? Yes. Is this safe to clear? Yes. So I'm just gonna pair both of these. So I'm gonna keep one hand here, one hand here. I'm just gonna pair and rub for a little bit. And then we're gonna reassess that movement pattern. And already I can tell I can stabilize better on that tripod foot. And I don't feel like I'm rolling and blowing in. So now that we have that movement, we wanna do incremental progression. So I may first off just do five nice and slow to get that movement pattern integrated. And then I want to load it. We want to use the rail, release, activate, integrate, load. So I'm going to do the same thing. Again, adding a little load. That might be a little too much for me yet. I could just do a band or shorten the movement. But you get the idea. That's how quick and fast DNA can be.